I'm Allie Stevens with a WKOK.com afternoon update. One man was killed in a fire last night in Sunbury. Keith Bordner died in the fire at his home at 1005 Penn Street in Sunbury. The fire started around 9 p.m. Crews were on the scene for several hours battling the blaze, which destroyed the home. Firefighters were called back out this morning when the fire rekindled around 7.15. The coroner was on the scene last night when firefighters found Bordner inside the home. The man was reportedly confined to a wheelchair and unable to escape. The investigation continues. A family was displaced by fire early this morning at 594 Grubbs Church Road near Port Traverton. The fire started around 4 a.m. Crews were on the scene until 6 this morning, started as a chimney fire and then spread into the walls of the home. Minor damage was reported. A family of five was able to escape the flames without injuries. They have not been identified. State police are investigating after a four-year-old child was found walking alone on Snydertown Road yesterday evening. Troopers say the child was picked up by an unknown person around 715 on Snydertown Road in Upper Augusta Township. The child was later found at his parents' home. It was discovered that one of the parents had driven to a nearby storage area and had accidentally locked the child and the keys in the car. The child was left alone in the car while the parents walked to their home. While the parents were gone, the child got out and began walking on Snydertown Road. The investigation continues. And motivational speaker Harriet Turk gave the keynote address for this year's Young Women's Future Symposium, hosted by Junior Achievement of Central PA. The day-long event gathers high school girls from Snyder, Union, Northumberland, Juniata, and Mifflin counties to participate in activities to help them determine what they want to do in the future. Turk told the women that if they do not stand up for themselves, then why should anyone stand up for them. The students had sessions on resumes, what to wear for an interview, social media, and deciphering their personality and what job would fit. And they also had a chance to talk with professional women throughout the valley. The Young Women's Future Symposium was held at Bucknell University. AccuWeather says clouds with showers today, a high 47. Tonight we'll see some rain or snow early and a low 26. Clouds and sun tomorrow, your high 38. See the complete AccuWeather forecast and more on these stories here at WKOK.com.